Hello everyone, my name is Shamira, aka Mimi. If you are new, welcome to my channel. If you're returning, welcome back. You guys, today I'm going to do a pick a card. Okay, three options. All right, you guys, and it's going to be who is crushing on you, okay? So, you guys, I have a channel song for each pile, and I will be doing a free flow type of uh, shuffle, okay, with four decks. So, yeah, you guys, um, let's get to it. I'm going to give you a few moments to tune into your intuition and pick the pile that is calling out to you the most, okay? So if you guys need to pause it, go ahead and pause it. I still will give you guys a few moments, okay? Yes. So let's start with pile one, okay? Pile one, you guys, who's crushing on pile one? You guys, the channel song that I got for you was um, You and I by Avant in Kiki Wyatt, okay? And I will leave the song with the um, link to the video, okay? Below in the description box next to the pile, okay? All right, you guys, so yes, yes. Yes, Paul, when I can definitely see you guys, um, this person is, I'm going to pull from the deck and I'm going to show you guys the cards uh, when I'm done, okay? So, Paul, when this person is absolutely in love with you, I think some of you guys might know who this person is. Um, this could be the person um, that you are currently with or um, an ex who do not appreciate you, okay? You guys didn't appreciate you. And just realize, you know, maybe you guys went through a recent blow up or something like that. And they realize how awesome you are. Or they just had to take some um, time out after losing you for them to see um, just how special you are and how much you mean to them, okay? Yes. Because you guys have a lot of chemistry. I think you guys get along well in some instances. But I, I don't think they... Um, one or both of you guys wasn't uh, ready to commit, okay? Maybe it was, you know, the person who was crutching on you or the person, um, yeah, this is someone you know, okay, Paul One? Yeah. I don't think they have access to you, okay? But yeah, they definitely look at you in a certain way, okay? Yes. Oh, my goodness, you guys, I'm getting so choked up. I have to cough. Something flew out. I don't look at it. It's still turned over. So, yeah, you guys. I'm going to pull a little bit from the tarot. But I'm getting kind of choked up, okay? <clears throat> mm. Excuse me. I'm sorry if you guys had headphones on. Oh, my goodness. These cards are flying out. They have a lot to say to you, okay? I swear I can get one more. Okay? Yes. Okay. Yes. And hell of the chemistry, baby. I, I'm living out life for you. Oh, darling. Yes. It's funny how things in life are not perfect. But when it comes to you, you're that him more, baby. Yes. Okay, you guys. Yes. Okay, I'm getting it. Okay. Heaven's my destiny when I'm with you. Yes. The only place to be just you and me. Oh, my life, my life, my life, my life is so incomplete. Yes, you guys, this person. Thank you, Sugar. Uh -oh. I'm Okay, go ahead. Go ahead, go play. So, yes, you guys, this person, you you cut this person out, okay, you guys? I got the Dalmatian, Dalmatian stone, okay? Maybe this person was giving you hot and cold type of vibes. You were like, uh-uh, okay. You know, I got um water, Mama Quocha. So, yeah. Queen of Swords, Seven of Cups, okay, Seven of Swords, Ace of Pentacles, and Sanctuary, okay, 
Okay, this person has a crush on you. Um, it could be a, a air sign or a water sign. Okay, but this person is right now at this moment is in their feelings. Okay, so some of you guys, like I said, maybe it's a person you are with now. You're probably not talking to them, but um, you guys might have taken a break. Okay, or you guys might have uh cut them off. It's definitely somebody you cut off because I do see this this Dalmatian stone. Okay. How do you think of uh, Cruella DeVille, okay? Maybe they think you're a mean person because you cut them off. But um, yeah, I, the 101 Dalmatians, okay? Remember she had like the red, it was the red, and I don't know if it was the red, it was the black and blonde hair, okay? Maybe this person is a Gemini, okay? Aquarius or Gemini, I'm definitely seeing that. Aquarius, Gemini, um, Pisces. Pisces, Cancer. All right, Scorpio too. Maybe this person had a lot of options, all right? And you thought that this person was exclusively in a relationship with you. And they weren't being honest. You know, they were sneaking around, keeping their options open, you know, and you kind of found out, okay? Because this is a clear, this is a clear message, you guys. Okay, you're like, yeah, absolutely no. Let me cut your ass off, okay? Because you, you got me after, Okay. Maybe they um maybe they didn't feel like they had enough to offer offer you. Okay, but this is what they want. They, they want stability with you, okay? They want you to forgive them. I'm definitely seeing that because they do feel like you're your their you are their sanctuary, okay? You're the place to be. Yeah, remember that line? Yes. Heaven's my destiny when I'm with you. The only place to be, just you and me. Yes. My life, my life, my life, my life is so incomplete without you, baby. I love Kiki Y. I love that part. Okay. Yeah, this person is really in their feelings. Okay. I'm definitely seeing the blues. The blues, you know, signifies water, okay, emotions. And I do think of the water signs of Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. This person is definitely in their feels about you um, because you cut their ass off. They were playing games with you. Or maybe they weren't decided. Um, maybe they didn't have enough to offer you and they knew it. So they kept their options open, but they didn't quite tell you. So they probably had you... Um, like stringing you along, you know, this person was playing games, you know, now, now that you cut them off, they want what they can't have. That's, that's how it is. Okay. Sometimes they definitely want what they can't have. Um, yeah, this person feels a little unstable now that you cut them off, now that you walked away from them. But you know, it's, it's, it's not, it's not your fault. It's not your problem. Any person, now that you see the little fish, the little fish right here. I don't know if you guys can see it. The little fish. Yeah. Pisces. They all in their fields, okay? They knew what they were doing. I ain't lost out on you. You want to come back? Yeah, come back to me. You're the only one. Yes. People don't know what they have till it's gone, right? So, yeah, that's who has a crush on you, Power One. I'm so sorry that it's, this was like really, you know, really just to the point. This person is definitely someone you cut off or someone you're not in contact with. Um, yeah, they lost. Okay, so I guess you guys on to the next one. This Mommy. person is definitely a person that I, I feel like honestly they didn't quite know what they want. And if anyone is like I said is confused about you, they're not the person for you. So this is not someone you should be engaging with. You know, it's the reason why you cut them off. And I think it's best for you guys to just stay where you are. After you cut them off, now they want stability with you. Absolutely not. Okay, no. All right, no. No. So yes, Paul One, I'm so sorry for the distractions. Okay, my son, we're gonna definitely talk to him about that. But if you didn't feel like this is your pile, please feel free to choose another pile. Okay, you guys. And um, if you like it, hit the like button. If you decide you didn't, leave it. All right. So yes, you guys, subscribe so you can get more pick card videos like this. And also, I do advice videos every Sunday and Wednesday. Probably not tomorrow because um, I'm recording this the day before Mother's Day because I'm going to take some time off to myself, okay? So yes, you guys, I will definitely see you guys next time or in the next poll. Bye.
So hello pal two, this is who's crushing on you, okay? So you guys, I'm gonna choose from four decks, all right? I'm gonna do a free style type of shuffle, all right? I'm gonna pull it as I go. The channel song for you guys is um, Only One by uh, Tamar Braxton, okay? Yes. So the person I feel you guys is crushing on you is, um, I think this could be a, a friend, okay? A friend or someone you look at as a friend. Uh, maybe someone you, uh, you know, pass by or someone who watches you. Uh, maybe on social media, okay? Maybe it's a person, like one of your fans or, um, you know, subscribers, supporters, uh, your followers on social media. But they look at you as a friend, okay? Yes. I think this is a friend. For some of you, for most of you, I think this is a friend, all right? Yeah, they, they are kind of afraid to um, talk to you about the relationship or talk to you about taking the relationship to the next level, okay? Yes. You know very well, young star. Yes. I, that's not what they said, but that's what I'm thinking, okay? They look at you like, damn. I'll, I'll let you guys see the cards, but I'm going to finish uh, shuffling you guys, okay? Yes. But I don't go that far as lovely you are. And you don't have to why once in my day. Yes. But I'm the only one the way you are. I remember the way we just did for so personal. You was my first and so was my love and now you're gone. But I don't even know what I'm baby. Without you, I'll make you me. My love, I just like so far. But it all on me. Something flipped over. Let me see what flipped over first. Something flipped over. I could have swear something flipped over. Oh, I'm tripping. Okay, I might be tripping. But yes, this person, how to, is definitely a friend, okay? Someone you do as a friend. Um, I don't really think that you guys, um, I think that this person told you or expressed to you how they felt before, but I do feel like um I don't know if you feel the same way. You know, they're not like in love with you, so I'm pretty sure this person knows uh, a bit about you. They have to be um your friend for a while or watching you for a while to know these things about you. Okay, yeah, they may feel like you know you've been putting, um you keep dating these people that isn't good for you. You know, but you don't see them as okay as an option and i do see why because sometimes you know we become friends with people they do feel like home they do sometimes feel like family and um sometimes you just don't view them as you know a, a romantic prospect okay i'm gonna let you guys see the cards in a few okay let me lay them out yes yes okay oh my you guys not gonna believe what okay what i just flipped over okay <laughs> so this person Wow, wow, pal, too. This person admires you, okay? Yes, okay. Yeah, this person definitely has a thing for you, okay? All right, all right, all right, okay. I hear you, pal, too, okay? Yeah, you're the only one. So, first, you guys got Amber, okay? That Amber. This person is definitely fiery. I think this is a fire sign, you guys. Yes, Leo, Aries, Sag, potential, you guys. There's no way. Potential. They look at you as a potential prospect, but I don't think you guys feel the same way. Maybe you guys think this person is, um, this person has too many, uh, groupies after them, but they have, you know, just, yeah, listen to that song. Yeah, you're the only one. Yeah. You're, you're so, yeah. Yeah, you had a few. Yeah, you got my heart. You had a few. Boy, one too many. Okay. This person definitely thinks that you um attract a lot of people. Okay. That isn't good for you. Maybe you guys are a fire sign, but I got fortune, you guys. And that is 27. That's a nine, right? And then I got this potential as a nine. Yes, this person looks like you like as fulfillment. Like they're like, yes, you're the one. Yes. 
You're the only one I want. Yes, leadership. They want to take the lead in this, um, this, you know, friendship. Okay, look, you guys, discernment. Yes, this person like, girl, boy, you better use your discernment. You know, I want you. <laughs> okay. Yes, expansion. Yes, yes, you guys. They want to expand with you. They want to go far with you. Look at you as a really beautiful uh, person, okay? Really handsome person. You're creative. I think some of you guys are fire signs, uh, and, and the fire sign is crushing on you, okay? Maybe, maybe they, like I said, they see you um, for who you are. They look at you as a great catch, okay? Yes. Six of swords. This person is in love. Look, four of swords. Yes. Yes, this person wants you. Okay. The world. And the emperor. This is Aries, okay? This is like my Leo. Sad, okay? This is like my Aries. You guys, this person is a fire sign. They're so into you. All right, oh, you're a fire sign. This person is crushing you heavy. This person is definitely a friend, and they, they're making it clear, like, oh, my goodness. Can't you see? Okay, I want you. You can't see? This person is in love with you guys, and I, I do believe this person um wants to take it to the next level, but you're kind of hesitating, like, no. You know, maybe this person, um you know, might have come on too strong. And it kind of scares you guys away. So, yeah, it's, it's, it's clear. It's clear as day. It's, it's, it's your friend. If you feel like, oh, my goodness, have they been hitting on me? Um, are, are they thinking of me in that way? They probably are. It's, it's, it's pretty clear. Okay, you guys, look at this. Emperor, the queen of wands, and the world. Okay, did I see the expansion? Expansion? Potential? Okay. Potential? Fortune? Yes, you guys are like this person's end all be all. All right. They're like, you know, I'm going to stop playing games. I'm going to go ahead and go in for the kill. Okay. I'm going to get what I want. So when I come to you, please just know that you're the only one. I might, you know, this person might have a whole bunch of holes in different area clothes and people running after them. Or a whole bunch of dudes simping after them, okay? But you're the only person that they want. They're telling you, like, don't worry about what everyone else is, is trying to get from me, okay? I know I'm a, I'm a really um, charismatic person, you know, magnetic person, you know? Just know that the person that you, is coming for you is the shit, you know? They kind of match your energy. They just want you to know that, you know, don't feel uh, insecure about... Uh, the type of attention that they get. The only person, like I said, they want is you. So yeah, Paul too. That is who has a crush on you. And you guys have definitely met your match. And this person is like, yes, when I get this leadership and I get the uh and I get the, the emperor, yeah, this person is, is definitely passionate about you, okay? All right, they're definitely sexually attracted to you. So they're, they're like, I'm going to take what I want. Okay, baby, I'm going in for the kill. Yes, boo. Oh, yes, you guys. Oh, Paul too. So, yeah, keep an open mind when it comes to this person. Try not to be uh, really, uh, you know, aggressive or um, I don't know if you guys aren't ready. I'm not going to, you know, you know, try to push you into a relationship with them because only you know this person. And maybe some of you guys know that. Um, and some things that they have to get rid of or some things they have to work on, okay? As far as their temper um, or as far as their need to can try to control you or um, <laughs> block out your competition, block out their competition in order to get you. Um, maybe they need to work on that. You guys know it. You guys don't want any jealous person coming after you, um, trying to force you to be with them. Only you guys would know, but I'm just saying, you guys, please keep an open mind because this person is is all for you, and I think they only have eyes for you. No matter how they you know, might seem, how they look, um, how they act, they're asking you guys to just yeah, open your eyes to me. I want you. You know we're we're a great fit, okay? Yes. I'm the type of person who would take who would take uh care of you. I always say control. <laughs> 
<laughs> if this person is controlling you guys, I say this person gets really jealous. They don't want anyone to have you. They're like, this person is really beautiful. This person is a catch. I want them. Okay, no one's gonna come near them. All right, they will stick this little this this snake. Is this snake on his chest? You guys see that snake on his chest? Like, yeah, get him, get him, snake. They're after my person. Oh, this person is is I don't know if they're in love with you, but I don't know. They just they just look at you as a a great catch. I don't know, you guys. Like I said, keep an open mind because because some some of you guys, this person might be a little controlling. This person might just want you because you make them look good, okay? But I don't see any cups. But I, I, I do feel like this person is, um, they, they hold you to a high regard, okay? You are definitely their, their end all be all. All right, you bring this person some type of healing, okay? Some type of mental relief. Sometimes you guys might, um, Get this person to stay out of their head, you know? You guys are healing in that way. Intellectual way, okay? A mental way. Not really emotional. But yeah, this person definitely is passionate about you. And I'm not going to lie, you guys, this person trying to smash. So that's all I'm saying. Don't act like you guys don't see it. But definitely, you guys, yeah, use your discernment when it comes to this person. If you feel like this isn't going to be a great fit for you guys, um... Then don't take the relationship to that level. But if you feel like, you know, you're all in, then do it, okay? I mean, you guys are friends anyway, so why not? So you guys call to let us move this question on you. And if you guys like this, please hit the like button. And if you guys feel like this did not resonate, um, feel free to choose another poll. Just leave it all together. I will not be mad, okay? So yes, Apollo 2, that is all. If you would like to subscribe, if you want to already subscribe, subscribe, okay? So you can get more video card videos like this one, plus advice videos every Sunday and Wednesday. But this Sunday will be Mother's Day. I am not going to be recording on that day. So yeah, you guys. <laughs>
And when you guys call them, they, they think that it's, you know, it's for something else. Because maybe some people may call them unnecessarily, you know, disrupting the uh, workflow uh, for, for, you know, for dumb things. You guys actually call them for a dilemma. So, yeah. I don't know how you call unexpected. Cause I hate when mom is expected. I'm a kid for you, you, you. Yes. Yes, this person definitely, um, yeah. Yeah, this person is of some, of some authoritative, uh, I'm gonna show you guys the cards in a moment. Okay, I got a lot of cards for this pile. Yes. This person might be at work, you know, when you call them over like, hey, boss, I need help with that. After they finish assisting you, they're like standing in the corner just watching you work. I guess that person is going to be mine someday. This person also might be married, you guys. It may be a boss, just some someone who um, can't have some type of, um, they can't have access to you um, because of morals, Okay. They may be committed. They may be already married or um, your boss. They're not supposed to be, you know, frolicking with the, oh, it is raining really hard, frolicking with the uh, employees. Okay, you guys, first came out was Black Tourmaline. Okay, that was 10. Yeah, maybe this person is divorced or something. Yeah, Pink Sapphire. They definitely have their eye on you, okay? Ellie. All right, focus. Beloved. Cycles. Oh. Think of cups. Five of Pentacles. <laughs> I didn't mean to laugh, you guys. Um, <laughs> three of three of uh, swords, ten of swords, another ten. Okay, and the Hermit. Okay, so you guys, this could be a boss who is divorced, um, who is kind of going through something. Okay. Or this could be someone who you divorce or are going through divorce. And maybe they're looking at you like, I don't want to get a divorce. And they're kind of heartbroken, okay? Yeah, they're kind of heartbroken. All right? They're, they feel like they're out in the cold, you know, because you ended things with them. They're like, you know, I'm having hope that we can get back together. Yeah, this person is definitely probably, uh, you know, I don't know. If, if you are... Divorcing this person, they don't want to sign the divorce papers. Okay, maybe they just think you guys going through a a cycle, you know, a, a bad time you're in, in your marriage or something. Because you know, I got this beloved, you know, it's two. This is like a, a, a kind of like a soulmate type thing. Okay, and this person is really in their head, like, oh my goodness, why well, this person really cut me off? Okay, um, and right now, you guys, I think you guys are fully focusing on healing yourself, all right? Someone broke your heart or you guys just decided you, you just were on two different pages or you guys, I don't know. I'm definitely seeing that some of you guys, this, this is a boss for others of you guys. This is a person that you're going to divorce, um, ex-spouse or soon to be ex-spouse, okay? This person is in really a uh, bad part okay bad part of it they're really in the, the shadow phase of you know whatever is going on okay and they're looking for new love and like i said if this is a boss maybe this is a boss who um is recently divorced or widowed but i'm seeing divorce all right and they're, they're, they're looking at you as a rebound like yes that person right there can be my this person can bring me bring me some type of healing because maybe some of you guys are like um you hold this this watery energy, this really comforting energy. Maybe you guys are really sweet, you know, and you feel like you guys connect on that level. Maybe this is a person, um, your boss comes and, and tells you about their problems and things like that. Because you guys kind of share a certain bond, um, they look at you like, um, yes, this person can be my next, you know. But I, I honestly think that you guys, this person is uh, is looking at you as a rebound. All right. 
So, I, I mean, if you decide, you know, to let them in, just know that maybe they could be on a break from their uh, marriage. They're going through something. This is their marriage, okay? It is, I, I can't, is this, there's no way, okay? Isolation. This person is in a doghouse probably for cheating, okay? Their heart is broken because they broke their person's heart. This is, this is definitely an ex-spouse <laughs> who was still crushing on you. Like, oh, the person ended. It ended, you know, they're in their feelings, okay? Looking for a rebound. I'm trying to manifest a rebound, okay? Because I see that's 44. That is an 8. Okay? And it's about manifesting things. Trying to manifest, you know, a rebound. Think that a rebound is going to heal them, and it's not. But right now, I think that um, they're so focused on their heart, okay? See this arrow, born arrow? Their heart is broken, you know? So the only thing they can get right now, they're trying to focus on getting over that, okay? Healing that. You know? They're looking out for they're looking at you as a um a rebound, you know, while they reflect on their feelings, okay? But deep inside they hope and wish they can get back with their person. Or if this is your spouse, your ex-spouse, they're they're hoping and wishing that this is just, you know, a cycle. With you guys, you guys are just having a really bad fallout. This person really wants to get back with you. Okay, pile three. So, yeah. Maybe they're on social media watching you guys, talking to you guys, trying to see if you guys moved on. But I think you guys are really focused on yourself. You know, focusing on work. Focusing on bettering yourself. Probably healing from the situation. But they're definitely hoping that you guys will come back. Yeah. Well, I'm going to say this, Paul 3. Use your discernment when it comes to this person because if you feel like it ended on, uh, it ended for a great reason, okay, you had a great reason to end this, um, stick to it, okay? Don't keep going back and forth. If you really want to end this, make sure you guys aren't going through a cycle, okay? Make sure the ending is exactly what you want. If you really want this ending with this person, if this is an ex spouse, um, Really go inside and, and, and reflect on your, your emotions, your feelings, and if this is uh what you truly want, all right? This person could be a Virgo, okay, a Virgo or um an Aquarius, a Cancer. All right. This person is really in their feelings. So yeah, yeah, Paul three. If you feel like this isn't your Paul, please feel free to choose another Paul. Um, if you like this, please hit the like button. And if you guys would like to subscribe, if you're already subscribed, subscribe, okay? So you can get more pink card videos like this one, plus advice videos every Sunday, Wednesday. But this Sunday, Mother's Day, I will not be posting, okay, or uploading or recording. This is my time off. All right, you guys. So yeah, if you guys feel like you didn't. Like I said, feel free to choose another pile or leave it all together. I will not be mad. Okay, Paul 3. So that is what is crushing on you. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.